We can define radioactivity as the spontaneous disintegration of unstable atomic nuclei with the emission of alpha, beta, gamma radiations and the release of energy is called radioactivity. It means radioactivity is a process by which an unstable nucleus decays into a new nuclear configuration that may be stable or unstable. If the daughter nuclei is unstable, it will decay further, through a chain of decays, until a stable configuration is attained. For example, cobalt-60 disintegrate until, it is converted into a stable element nickel, and during decay, it emit beta particle, and gamma radiation. Activity represents, the total number of disintegrations of parent nuclei per unit time. As time increases the number of undecayed nuclei, present in radioactive sample is decreases, hence, number of decay per second means activity of the sample is decreases. The SI unit of activity is the becquerel, 1 becquerel is equal to, 1 disintegration per second. The older unit of activity is the Curie, it is defined as the, number of disintegration per second, from 1 gram of radium and, it is found to be, 1 Curie is equal to the 3.7 into 10 raised to power 10, disintegration per second. Currently, the activity of 1 gram of radium 226 is 0 0.988 Curie. Now we see exposure rate constant. It is defined as the exposure per hour from 1 millicurie point source at a distance of 1 cm. Let's consider a point source. It emits radiation. Exposure rate constant tells about the exposure per hour. In other words we can say amount of ionizing radiation per hour that is radiation level at 1 cm distance from the 1 millicurie point source. Unit of exposure rate constant is Rontgen centimeter square per millicurie hour. For example, the exposure rate constant of cobalt, cesium, and iridium radioisotopes are given in this table. Now we see what is RHM. If the exposure rate constant is defined, for one Curie source at 1 meter, then it is called RHM, Röntgen hour meter. It is defined as the exposure per hour from one Curie point source at a distance of 1 meter, and it is expressed in Röntgen meter square per Curie hour. Mostly, RHM is employed for calibration purposes, in brachytherapy and industrial radiography. In practice, RHM of a given radioisotope can be obtained by dividing the exposure rate constant by a factor 10. Means, we can find the value of RHM if exposure rate constant of a radioisotope is given. Now we see what is RMM instead of hour 1. Can also express it for 1 minute, then it is called RMM, Röntgen minute meter. It is defined as, the exposure per minute from one Curie point source, at a distance of 1 meter, and it is expressed in Röntgen meter square per Curie minute. RMM is the most preferred and useful terminology in teletherapy source calibration. In practice RMM of a given radioisotope can be obtained by dividing the RHM value by 60. RMM value is related with Curie, for example for cobalt 60 source, RMM value is 0 0.217, and according to definition of RMM, it is, corresponding to one Curie source and, 
1 RMM corresponding to 46.08 Curie. Example 1. If a cobalt teletherapy source is purchased with 200 RMM capacity, what is the corresponding activity of the source in Curie? Example 2. If a cobalt teletherapy source is purchased with 10,000 Curie capacity, what is the corresponding RMM value? 